Howdy folks, in our last adventure we left off stealth camping on a beach in Rhode Island. As our journey continues, we head north, getting closer to our goal of Acadia National Park. But first we decided to do a little hiking along a cliff before saying goodbye to Rhode Island. Ah, yeah. <laughs> sorry, I gotta watch where I walk, I don't want this to me. What is this place? 40 steps. It's on a cliff walk. Ooh. So we're gonna walk on cliffs. Um, perhaps? I don't think like dangerous cliffs. It's not like we're walking on this. <laughs> we'll probably fall. Yeah, that'd be bad. Nice snowing you viewers. <laughs> Neat. Don't have my swimming trunks on, so I think I'll stay where it's dry. I better get out of here. So this is called 40 steps? It is, but I swear I counted more. All right, let's go. Let's find okay. out. are just bonus steps that you get to do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight more. I feel like we've been deceived. <laughs> well, a little bit. <laughs> it was only supposed to be 40. Yeah. We went like 48. Right? So that extra eight. Whew. Good thing I'm in tip top shape. Me too. Oh, working on that. Yeah. Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> Just seeing if I could see anything, but you really can't, even at this. Almost clear. Well, here, there you can. You can catch a glimpse of one house. Oh, are they like mansions? Yes. At least that was the promise. And from what I've seen around here, there are a lot of nice big houses. Very big, very nice. Too big. Take uh, a small army to take care of them. That's why we chose a truck camper. Why jump out of a perfectly good airplane? I'm hungry. Me too. What do you want? I don't know. Maybe something different this time. Something we haven't had in a while. Okay. Probably should eat though before we get on the road. Yeah. Okay. Sounds like a plan. Mm. Attention professional drivers, driver number 179, shower 2, is now available. That's one of us. It is. Are you first? Or I am don't I first? You can go first if you want. Okay. Going. Yesterday was a shower on the beach. Actually this morning. Yeah. Tonight we stopped at a truck stop. Things you gotta do sometimes. Not too bad. A lot better than a lot of campground shower houses, that's for sure. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna get showered. Back in the truck. All cleaned up. How was your first truck stop shower experience? 
Mine was good. Was it? Yeah, it was it was clean in mine. Mine was e. There was uh. This might be TMI, but there was little chunks of poop still in the toilet from the previous guy, and I knew as soon as I walked in, somebody had just dropped one in there. I was like, ugh. But there was that, and there was a big old toenail clipping on the floor. I guess, well, and then a nasty stain on the hand towel. But other than that, it was okay. <laughs> Have I mentioned I'm a germaphobe? <laughs> I am one. Anyhow, well, it's 11.34 at night and we haven't had dinner yet. I'm not sure if she's gonna eat. I just might not. <laughs> but I might. And then we're gonna try to find a place to stealth camp tonight. I think we have a couple places in mind. Yeah, I looked at a couple things. Yeah, we'll go check them out. See how they turn out. Found a little place to stealth camp on the street here in Portsmouth, New Hampshire. So we have to be pretty stealthy. Don't want any problems, so. A little late night snack since we kind of skipped dinner. I'm skipping the snack too. <laughs> She's skipping the snack. So I'm gonna do a peanut butter and jelly sandwich or something. No, peanut butter and honey. So that's my favorite. And when I said earlier about getting something different, and then we had Chick-fil-A. I really did get something different at Chick-fil-A. I don't normally get a salad. But you Today still Chick-fil-A. Today I did. It was still Chick-fil-A, but it was not my normal. So it was something different. Okay. <laughs> However we justify it. But you eat way more peanut butter than you do. This is true. Probably the only thing I eat more than Chick-fil-A. <laughs> I do not have Chick-fil-A every day. It may seem like it. Sure you want some? I'm sure. I already brushed my teeth. Okay. I know I could brush them again. <laughs> but I'm good. I'm gonna finish this up. And hit the hay. We're both tired. So, we'll see you in the morning. Have a good night. Good morning. Good morning. We slept well. No problems on the street. Nobody bothered us, so, we just stopped at this little park. Neat little view. And we're gonna use the facilities, so. And we're gonna get on the road. We have a morning shower here. All right. Well, we made it to Maine. Yep. So about three hours away from Acadia National Park. We should get there about this afternoon. Yeah, early afternoon, so. There it is. That's Acadia National Park. And that was our destination. And that, that is my wife. <laughs> so we have another 20 minutes or so to get to the campground. So, I'm excited. Yeah, we gotta try to beat sunset. Yeah. I looked it up, it's 8.08 and it's 7.25. Yeah, so. so it's earlier than we're used to, so. Yeah. <laughs> Back on the road.
We made it. We're here. I feel like we should like pick the dirt up and smell it. Oh, not just kiss the ground like some people do when they arrive somewhere. Kind of germaphobe. Yeah, or were you meaning like they do on those travel shows? Yeah. When, oh, they pick when, the, like, the scat. They scat and they're like, oh, that smells Ooh, fresh. There's a barrier. <laughs> That it was just here 20 there. minutes ago. <laughs> so now we have to set up a tent because this is a tent only site. So we're going to sleep in the tent tonight. Yeah. <laughs> I slept in a tent like one time years ago in our backyard. Is that when you got abducted by aliens? Probably. I'll we'll have to share that story sometime. <laughs> I have no recollection of that event. That's why. <laughs> yeah. They do that on purpose. Right. <laughs> and yeah, gotta set up a tent. Okay, we don't need the stinking instructions, he says. Maybe we needed the stinking instructions. You're figuring it out. It just may have taken less time. I don't know. Kevin. We did not need the directions. What on earth are we eating? We are eating what we have. <laughs> How did this happen? Well, we got here a lot later than what we had indicated earlier in the day that we would. Everything was closed. We thought we could stop and get something. Yeah. And we could have. If you took an hour to drive six, six miles, miles or eight miles, something like that. Yeah, it was six miles, but then it's actually 40 miles because of how the water is and the land is. So yeah, it's six miles if you have a boat. Um, and we were not gonna drive two and a half more hours. No. Just to go get something to eat. <laughs> no. So we have snap peas and carrots and chicken, some of which was purchased for another meal that we'll probably make tomorrow that we had at one point thought about making tonight, but it was too late for that. I think it'll be tasty. Well, good night. Good morning. Slept pretty well. Got some awesome pictures of the uh, stars last night. So beautiful, so clear. But uh, we had to check out of this campground by 10, and it's like probably 9.30. So we gotta get out of here. And then we have to move to another campground, so I'm guessing it's going to be an hour, hour and a half drive to the next one. So yeah, tear down my tent. I don't really have time to make breakfast right now. So everything packed up, maybe find some cool spot, hang out a bit, and make some breakfast and check out the park. Yeah, I'm still tired.
Such a beautiful view out here, huh, honey? Yes. You were just admiring the view, weren't you? I was replying to our daughter, oh. <laughs> who commented on the picture of this that I sent. Oh, okay. I was telling her where we are. <laughs> Glad we gave Maine a second chance. We came here years ago, but we didn't come far enough in. We were just kind of like, eh. Check it off the list. Yeah, checked it off our, our list. Yeah, we've hit 48 out of 50 states. The only two that are left are Hawaii and Alaska. We actually talked about going to Hawaii instead of this trip. But with all the uh, cancellations and the flights and the craziness going on there, we just decided, let's drive. I don't like seeing on camera. Well, that is about it for this adventure. We hope you join us next time, where we will visit some absolutely spectacular places in Acadia National Park, and we may even get caught in a thunderstorm. We are so glad that you are here, and can't wait to continue our journey with you. Until then, Godspeed.